Hey everybody, on this video we have a uh, Master Lock uh, digital safe. It's a X125ML is the brand. Similar to like the Amazon Basics or Century Safes that look similar to this or look the same, just with a different uh, brand on it. And I see the keypad's dead. So we're going to use uh, some really cheap, crappy lock picks to open it up here. Now this is a Goso brand. Uh, pretty much any pick set you find on eBay or Amazon is going to have these two tools, so any of those will pretty much work. And so there is a uh, key way here for, you know, a key override. But uh, if you don't have a key, then, you know, your pretty much only option would be to pick it. And so the only challenging part about this kind of lock, it is a wafer lock, which is like what filing cabinets use. They're pretty cheap, crappy locks for the most part. Uh, this one is double-sided, though, so there's tumblers on both sides. So you do need to be able to get in there and pick both sides. So... Pick the left side first here, okay. And everything that one click, everything else is springing over there. This has a dead core, so I can pull my tool out and it doesn't uh, rotate back on its own. Just move it to the other side and get in here and pick the other side. And we are open. So now it's turned. You know, we can go ahead and turn our knob, get in our safe, get out what we need. And, uh, you know, put new batteries in, change combination, whatever you got to do with it. And um, so that's, uh, you know, picking the Master Lock uh, digital safe here with, it's about the cheapest picks you can buy. Uh, questions, comments, or anything, put them in the comments. And um, pretty much all we got for this one. Well, I'll talk to everybody later.